picking out the perfect prom dress. I just want to wear a dress that I feel amazing in and just have a lot of fun with my friends. 17 year old Amelia Marcus Brock is perfecting a safety plan. Around this time every year, the teen substance prevention group ASAP of Anderson launches a social media campaign to encourage kids to stay sober on prom night and avoid drinking and driving. For the first time, though, they're paying students like Amelia to help make their message stick. We're just trying to let all of our youth know that even though like drinking and doing drugs might seem fun, it can get out of hand really easily. So just informing them that it's a dangerous thing, that they need to be aware of that. While the students are busy talking with the students, the ASAP adults have a word for the parents. Three out of four teenagers say that their parents are their number one influence in them not drinking or doing drugs. So it's very important that parents have those conversations. The group's communications manager, Chantel Harris, says 33% of alcohol-related traffic deaths happen during prom season. Their mission appears to show success as fewer students are turning to alcohol. But we still see um, about 3% or so of students um, doing underage drinking. But we do see other substances like Delta 8 and vaping on the increase. They've even seen more than a 50% drop in substance use. I just hope that all the youth my age realize that just doing drugs or drinking alcohol isn't worth it. And there are a lot of other ways to have fun on prom night. Making it a night to remember. In Anderson County, Gwendolyn Ducree, WVLT News.